General Atomics Aeronautical Systems Incorporated GAASI, on April 26 announced that the Army National Guard ARNG, has received a fiscal year 2023 congressional funding for 12 new Grey Eagle 25M GE 25M unmanned aircraft systems UAS. The funding comes after Army National Guard states, which make up 45% of the U.S. Army's combat divisions, requested GE 25MS to make ARNG Division's multi-domain operations MDO, capable, deployable, and better able to team with newly formed Division Artillery Brigades Divati. They will also be available to support domestic missions, such as homeland defense and disaster response, as needed. The GE 25M UAS is a very versatile aircraft said GAASI Vice President of DoD Strategic Development Patrick Shortsleeve. Grey Eagle is a valuable tool that gives the ARNG capabilities that match the organizational and doctrinal reconnaissance, surveillance, and target acquisition RSTA, requirements of active Army divisions with up to 40 hours of continuous flight. GE-25M is equipped with the new Eagle Eye Multi-Mode Radar and Electro-Optical Infrared Sensors, and can host a wide range of additional kinetic and non-kinetic payloads. Equipping ARNG divisions with organic GE-25MS makes possible the necessary mission planning, targeting, communications, detailed coordination, and realistic training needed to employ the system successfully in combat. GE-25M will allow ARNG divisions to have divisional ISR for the first time. The Grey Eagle UAS has a proven record of performance with millions of hours of safe operations, including automatic takeoff and landing capability. The aircraft excels as an enabler for fires, maneuver, network, and intelligence operations. It is also an integral part of the Army aviation team, working closely with manned rotary wing systems to achieve overmatch against pacing threats. Delivery of GE-25M capability to the ARNG will deepen the skill and experience of the whole force. Not only will the aircraft enhance the lethality of the United States Strategic Reserve, but it will also spread the operational burden more broadly. ARNG Grey Eagle companies will be able to deploy to operational theaters and conflicts where, to date, only regular Army Grey Eagle units have been supporting deployments.